Daisy and the Egg by Jane Simmons. How many eggs now? asked Daisy. Four, Aunt Buttercup said proudly. My three and Mama's green one. Your aunt's sitting on an egg for me, explained Mama Duck. Can I sit on one too? asked Daisy excitedly. It wasn't easy. Every day, Mama Duck sent Daisy over with food for Aunt Buttercup. Daisy listened as the chicks tapped softly inside their shells. You'll have a big brother or sister soon, said Aunt Buttercup. Daisy was so excited. When Daisy and Mama Duck went to visit Aunt Buttercup the next day, she was flapping her wings. They're hatching, they're hatching, she called. One of Aunt Buttercup's ducklings had cracked its shell. Daisy watched her first cousin struggle out. Yuck! He's all wet, said Daisy. Shh, scolded Mama Duck. Then Aunt Buttercup's other two ducklings hatched. While Mama Duck and Aunt Buttercup talked about names, Daisy waited for Mama's egg. She thought she heard something, but nothing happened. They all listened, but still there was no sound from the egg. That night, Mama Duck sat on her egg, but the next day, it still hadn't hatched. Some eggs just don't hatch, said Mama Duck. Come and play with your cousins, Daisy. But Daisy wanted to stay with Mama's egg. Daisy made a hole in the feathers, rolled the egg in, and sat on top. Come along, Daisy, called Mama Duck. But Daisy wouldn't move. It was getting dark and Daisy was cold and tired. Mama Duck came back. We'll sit together until morning, she said kindly. Yes, said Daisy. Pip, pip, pip. Daisy woke up. It was the egg. Her new brother struggled out of his shell and said, Pip, pip. Quack, said Daisy. Pip, he said again. Pip, said Daisy. Hello, Pip, said Mama Duck. And together they watched the sunrise on little Pip's hatching day. <laughs>